Hello and welcome back to HWL Radio Sports. I'm here with the co-host. Tony Ellis from Don't Stop Corporation. Guys, it's Friday, June 15th, 2018. We have our 2018 World Cup, FIBA World Cup, that is. And uh, the news, top story of the World Cup news is Russia ended a 16-year wait for the victory in the tournament by routing Saudi Arabia 5-0 yesterday in Group A. The first time the nation... Uh, won the World Cup since 2002. And guess who was there? The president, Vladimir Putin, was there on the sidelines cheering them on. Uh, they, right now, you know, United States ain't in the World Cup this year. Mm-hmm. So that's going to look pretty ugly for the United States, but the other countries must move on. Um, they won. They beat Saudi Arabia 5 nothing yesterday, and they had some games slated today. Today you got uh, Egypt uh, versus Uruguay. That was this morning, so they should have a score on that coming up. Okay. Then they got, they got, what they did, they broke it down in group, two groups. They got group A, well, actually group A, group B, group C, group D, group uh, E, group F, group G, and group H. And then what happens, they uh, form yeah. one of them groups. How many teams living. is in soccer, boy? Sounds yeah. like this is yeah. big, uh, and, bigger yeah, than is. football. Well, and actually, it's, it's how they broke it down, Hollywood. Huh? They got, uh, you know, what the world here is. They got four teams in each group. Like in Group A, you got Russia, Egypt, Uruguay, and Saudi Arabia. Then Group B, you got Iran, Morocco, Portugal, and Spain. Group C, Australia, Denmark, France, and Peru. Group D, Argentina, Russia, Iceland, and Nigeria. Group E, Brazil, Costa Rica, Serbia, Switzerland. Then Group F, Germany, Mexico, South Korea, Sweden. Group G, Belgium, England, Panama, Tunisia. Group H, Colombia, Japan, Poland, and Senegal. That's the groups. Now, the top two of the top players will be playing Lionel Messi, and then you get uh, Cristo Ronaldo. So, they'll be playing them two of the top players in the World Cup this year. But it's going to be exciting, man, because the winner takes it all, and that's a big, big prize. Mm-hmm. And, and then. Uh, you know, just the other day, they awarded the, the uh, 2026 World Cup to the northern countries, like the United States and Mexico and uh, Canada. They got it. So they'll be moving around then. But they did say Indianapolis will not host nothing. So that was some sad news in Indianapolis. They thought Indianapolis would be hosting something. Dang. And I wanted, I, I wanted to give some dates for the quarterfinals the semifinals in third place in the championship. So everybody can just be aware, you know, if you got your favorite team. Uh, the quarterfinals date is slated for Friday, July 6th. The semifinals uh, date is slated for Tuesday, July 10th. Third place, Saturday, July 14th. And then the championship is for July 15th. Okay. So we're looking at about, it's about, it's about a month away they have a championship. So what about this, uh, this news here that I heard about? Uh, they said that the World Cup is supposed to be coming to North America. Mm-hmm. Is that this this one or is that the next no, one? No, t- 2026, the, the next the next one. Oh, okay. So how yeah. big is that? Actually, it's the one it's the one after that because the next one. I'm sorry, I'm gonna correct that. 2022 will be in. Um, it's in. Uh, it's in a hot one, well, a hot country. What's it called? Why don't I my time? It's in. So it's in an Arab country. And then the 2026, so not the next one, just the third one will be in North America. It's every four years. All right, so how big, how big is that for North America? Huge, huge, huge. I'm not talking about huge. We're talking about, like, I'll put it like this. A billion? Yeah. Any city that hosts the game, it's talk, I mean, it's, it's, it's over. You're talking about money. The whole world is coming. And more. You got, you got, like this, you got your country coming plus the world. That's how big it is. Uh-huh. And soccer is huge. Oh, okay. Because so, uh, we be having huge stuff, and that just be the states coming. I mean, well, actually, uh, the United the States country, coming. United yeah. States, right. Now, imagine, imagine your country plus the world. So that's how big it's going to be. Yeah. Well, what city could yeah. even hold that, though? Like, well, they, who's well, going to have was, a many, was, that many hotels and shit? Available? Well, it, that's going to be, the, it's, it's based on, they, they, they base a lot on, that's a good question. They based on a lot of the hotel accommodation, and they based a lot on, the uh, stadiums. The stadiums got to be up par, got to be big stadiums, and it got to be nice stadiums that modern. That's what Sound they look kind of like Texas. <laughs> yeah, what well, Dallas, uh, uh, Arizona, uh, where the Cardinals play. 
and be pressed like that. And they was hoping locals all could pull it off, but they didn't. And it happens. They tried their best. I don't think they're big enough for the world. They're putting their beds in now. Um, So that's what's going on with that. But it's it's interesting that today is today is the fifteenth in one month. One month from the day. They ain't big enough for the world, even though we did do good with the Super Bowl. They did wonderful with the Super Bowl. They did better than what people thought they would. Mm -hmm. So um, So I don't know though. Look, I don't know. (laughs) They could do better than we thought they'd do with the World Cup. Well, you never know. I mean. You never know. It's just a matter of time. So we'll see. So what you think about uh, Russian president attending? He was there on the sideline cheering on, too. He, well, I got the big, number you know? one question everybody else want to know. Has Donald Trump ever uh, went, uh, the president ever stood by uh, any team in the Olympics, the United States president? How Donald Trump did? Well, you said that was in the World Cup. Uh, yeah, this is the World Cup. All this right, so it. have yeah. no. I'm saying like the, any United States president has he stood by the uh, World Cup people side? Uh, not that, not to my knowledge. Yeah. Not to my knowledge. That's what I, that's what I think yeah. about it. I think we need yeah. more motherfucking support from the president with our soccer right. players. But I did want to let the world know because our show we we do have a complete show, uh, hwradio.com. We leave you guys with no information. Unheard of. We always gonna give you full information. I did want to uh, give you some information that we wanted to get out. Uh, 2022 World Cup. It will be held in Qatar. That's the country. Oh. Qatar. And it's going from uh, November 21st to December 18th. It's one of the money countries over there too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I was telling. Yeah, because you know people wanted to know. I know I mentioned it. I didn't tell you what country, but I did want to tell you before we get off the air because you need to know. You know, we want to give you the best information on this show as possible. Well, but like you said, uh, you know, it's gonna be it's gonna be interesting. They was happy because they didn't think we was gonna get it. I tell you, who almost got it, man. And it was this far, and they was man. It was Morocco. Morocco almost got 2026. Yeah, they almost got it, and they were so happy that they gave it to a northern country. Right, so, so we we beat out French Montana city. I mean, yep, it was his yep. country. <laughs> Morocco. Yep, Morocco beat them out. So, mm-hmm. Well, that's gonna be the show for today. So go ahead and shoot your shot. Hey, guys, have a great day. Have a great weekend. And have a great Father's Day weekend, too, for all you fathers out there. And remember, always remember, be good to yourself as well as to others. Thank you. All right. And there you have it, another great show at HWL Radio Sports. Go over to hwlradio.com, download the music app. Also, make sure you check out the sponsors page. And like I always say, hit my motherfucking music. And if you don't hear the music, it's because you didn't listen. And go over to hwlradio.com and download the music app. And we out.